Hello, welcome to my presentation on how to quickly square multiples of 5 in your head. First of all, I want to say that I'm a big advocate of learning how to do mathematics the old-fashioned standard way. I believe in learning the multiplication table because it is a tool you can carry in your head the rest of your life. There will be times when you will not have a calculator with you. But when a student has mastered the standard way of doing mathematics and has a full understanding of the decimal number system, then there is no reason for him not to learn a shortcut to quickly calculate an answer within his head. Now let's review the standard method of squaring a number. Here we have the number 25, and we'll start with the 5. 5 times 5 is 25 and we'll put the 5 underneath the number we're working with and we'll carry the 2 up to the next column. Now we'll multiply the 5 and the 2 and we'll get uh, 10. Now let's add the 2 and uh, we carried earlier and we get 12 which we'll place in front of the 5 here. Now let's move on to the 2 here and um, 2 times 5 is 10. We'll put the 0 below the number we got before. Here directly in line with the 2 we're working with. Now let's carry the 1 and we'll place it here. 2 times 2 equals 4. Add the 1 we had carried earlier and we get 5. Now all we need to do is add these numbers to get our answer. Here we drop the 5 add the 2 and the 0 and we get 2 and we'll add the 1 and the 5 to get a 6. Here we have the answer to the problem. It is 625. Now let's move on to the shortcut. First of all I'm going to rework the previous problem using the shortcut. We will start with the 5. 5 times 5 is 25 so we'll put the 25 here. Notice I did not carry the number like I did in the standard way. Now we add a 1 to the number in front of the 5 here and we get a 3. Now we'll multiply the 2 here with a 3 and we get 6 which we place in front of the 25 we got earlier. This is our answer 625. Now let's try another problem. Here we have 65. 5 times 5 is 25. Add the 1 to the 6 here to get a 7. Now we say 6 times 7 is 42, which we place in front of the 25 to get 4,225. This is our answer. Now let's um, try a bigger number. Here we have 115. We'll work this the same way. 5 times 5 is 25. Add 1 to the 11 to get 12. 11 times 12 is 132, which we place in front of the 25 to get 13,225. This is our answer. I hope this presentation of how to quickly square multiples of 5 in your head has been helpful. Thank you for watching.